Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you for clapping. <laughs> Appreciate it. They told me in the back that they are recording this. So, thank you. All right, let's get to the issues. I, uh, I think little people deserve equal rights. I do. I do. Yes. Yeah. I think it's time little people be treated equally. It's 2016. Yet everywhere I go, separate drinking fountains. <laughs> when that joke gets applause, I feel like I'm starting a movement. Yes. <laughs> you, should, uh, you should never have sex at Olive Garden. Uh, when you're there, you're family. <laughs> So I, uh, I wear a lot of flannel, because I'm pretty butch for a lady. I, uh, <laughs> I do. I, I wear a lot of fl flannel. makes me look like the brawny man if they made a weak paper towel. Yeah. <laughs> There's some off-brand, can't pick up shit paper towel. Yeah. <laughs> Picture me in the mountains, like, I don't want to be in the mountains. Yeah. <laughs> Do I wear a lot of flannel? My friend was like, Brad, the 90s called. And I said, I know they don't text. <laughs> Little uh, landline humor. I, uh... I, uh, it's got to be frustrating being uh, Chester the Cheetah, you know? He's, uh, he's a mascot for Cheetos, but he has perfectly white fingers. Yeah. <laughs> Because of jokes like that, I get offered weed a lot. Uh, <laughs> I don't really smoke weed, but I don't want to be rude to people, you know? <laughs> feel bad, because they're being generous. That's a nice thing. Like, I found the most polite way you could decline someone's weed is just to say, nah, I'm a cop. <laughs> nah, all right, never mind. <laughs> So uh, there's, this, uh, there's this movie theater I, I go to back home that uh, re-shows old movies, which is cool, but they need more room on their marquee. They need more space on that sign. Like, I can't describe the emotional roller coaster I went on during the two seconds I thought Gremlins Fight Club was a movie. <laughs> I was like, I want to see Gremlins Fight Club. You know? <laughs> That movie would have so many rules. <laughs> so there are no more heroes, you guys. That's sad, no more heroes. Hulk Hogan, Bill Cosby, no more heroes. <laughs> like, uh, like, I love Pee Wee Herman. I think he's a national treasure. I love him. Uh, yeah, someone told me he had a scandal many years ago. Uh, apparently, he got caught masturbating in a movie theater. I don't blame him for that. I don't blame him. Everything in his house had eyes. So, uh, so dragons, you know? Uh, <laughs> dragons breathe fire. It, uh, it'd be fun watching one try to cool down soup. <laughs> I, uh, I did that joke at a show one time, and this guy came up to me afterward. He was like, that joke you do about dragons? I said, yeah. And he said, fire doesn't burn a dragon's mouth. Why would soup? <laughs> Thank you so much. Hey. That was great. Thank you. Oh, that's a great job. Awesome. That's fantastic. Brad Winslow!